What's up my PT peeps? One Eye Bri back to do an unboxing of one, two, three boxes. We got Geek Fuel, we got Bambox, and we got Loot Crate DX. So, bam, bam, there we go guys. Let's get to it. Let's start with, I guess the Bam Box here. They all came today, so I might as well do a mega unboxing of all three. I can't remember what these are, the themes and stuff. So, here we go. Bandbox pin, February's theme, the 90s. Super Soaker, very cool, because the Super Soaker pin. Super Soakers were everywhere. We got a Beanie Baby, 2000. The original Beanie Baby. Those were like the rage. Some of you were like born in the 90s, I'm sure. We got a puck from, oh man, that was cool. It's a puck, you can't really, I think it says MB or something. This official size hockey puck has been hand signed by Matt Doherty who played Les Averman in the Mighty Ducks movie franchise. So that's pretty cool. Matt Doherty, so I guess it's a MD with a, with a squiggle, but it's just a signed thing. But he's uh, the guy with the glasses, Les Averman. If you don't know the Mighty Ducks, you better watch that movie, of that series. Uh, it's pretty cool. We got this. Got some of that. We got here. Boston Creative Products. Boston Creative Products, it says on the box. And we got, we have a spoon. No soup for you, it says on the, on the spoon. For those who don't know, No Soup For You is from the Seinfeld episode, The Soup Nazi, and it's a great episode, and No Soup For You is very iconic, very cool, and you just have the box, and here is uh, another card for something, or the, the cheat sheet for the box. What do we got here? What do we got here? Oh. We have... The Moonbase Melee, Austin Powers. Dr. Evil versus Austin Powers. And whatever happened to Mike Myers? This is just a movie poster, a little fake thing for that. The Fight for the Mojo. Whatever, these used to be like hilarious movies and Austin Powers used to be a big deal. Mike Myers, whatever happened to you, man? I mean, I haven't heard good things about Mike Myers. Like he's a diva and he's a pain in the ass to work with, but we got the poster and the 90s theme. <laughs> Could have got a Furby, which I actually have a real Furby. The uh, shoes, sneakers, and a squirt gun, super soaker. I got that. I got this beanie baby. You could have got a chicken, a monkey, or a shark. Who else could you gotta get? Uh, Matt Doherty is the signature. Very cool. You might also remember him as So I Married an as Heed in So I Married an Axe Murder. Heed, move. You could have got oh, Agent Smith versus Mr. Anderson Neo for that, or you could have got the Bayside Brawl, which was Zach and Slater. I got the Mike Myers one, which is crap, but it's all right. I would have rather had the uh, Say by the Bell one and the No Soup for You. That's the Soup Nazi on there. If you don't know, now you know for that and the Super Surfer pin. So overall, pretty cool, pretty nostalgic for the 90s, that's for sure. All right, let's do Geek Fuel. I'll do the big stuff for the Loot Crate last. Okay. Boom. I think this is Legend of Zelda. It's all exclusive for Geek Fuel. I think that's the book. The shirt. Is it Link? I'm guessing it's a Link. If it's all Zelda stuff, you better get a Link thing, right? The thumbs up or the thing on the back. Nope. Nuka World Amusements. I don't know. I, don't, I, I haven't played Zelda since the first so I don't know I don't know who the dog is personally 
All right. We got a card. Archibald's Adventure. Steam key code on card. I'm going to scratch this off later and reveal it later on a different one. So stay tuned for those. But you want to visit steampower.com slash get steam, download and run steam install, blah, blah, blah. But I'll just I'll scratch that off at a later date and I'll, I'll give it to you guys. Here's their little stupid pin thing. Stranger Things edition. Pretty cool. I didn't get the rare one. I got the real world one. It is like that limited edition collector's pin. The guy with no teeth. Stranger Things, if you've not seen Stranger Things, I recommend it. Property of Bruce. I don't know what that is, but that could be uh, some reference. Oh, I guess it's Bruce Wayne as Batman. It's like a little baby poster of baby Bruce. Pretty cute. Wham! Pow! Arkham. Little Joker, little penguin, little bat car there. That's kind of cool. That's definitely kind of cool with that. We got sticker. What do we got here? Made in China. The Power of the Sword. The Power of the Sword Portable Charger. This is taped. Yeah. Of course it'd be taped, right? You know. Double, double taped. Double taped. Ba -na -na. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. This is the Zelda I know. Zelda 1. That's when stuff was fun like that. Oh, that's pretty cool. It's like a sword. That's the charger on the bottom with that. But look at that. It's pretty cool. It's pretty solid. I mean, it's just like the charger would be. I don't know. That's pretty sweet, actually. Yeah. I mean, that's a cool, cool thing. I mean, look how small it is. You know, it's not it's not big at all. It's just a good design. It's pretty cool. Hopefully it holds a charge or whatever, or provides a charge with when you're traveling. I know a lot of people like to make conventions and everything on there too. And the last things, there's the card. Too much stuff! Ah! Nuka World Amusements prize ticket. Enter your ticket. Geekfuel.com slash NukaWorld. 0411163. You got a prize ticket. I don't know what that is. So, let's see. Here's the things we got. So, the Geek Nation community, it all seemed a lot more amusing before you actually showed up. Now, the games are deadly and the crews are lawless, leading gangs and taking over sections of the park, blah, blah, blah. I don't know. I don't know what that dog thing is, whatever. And the blue variant of this poster is like all blue Batman, which is cool. The 8-bit sword portable charger, which is pretty cool. I like that. The hero in training poster print. That's kind of cool. You could have got the all blue. You see there, it's all blue there. Could have got the limited edition pin, that, and then the Nuka World Amusement Prize giveaway. So... I don't know. Overall, kind of cool. The t-shirt, I just don't get, but that doesn't mean it's not cool. Kind of like the color. The Batman thing is kind of cool. You know, different kind of print on it. So let me just get this out of here. Overall, I don't know. It's kind of cool. The charger was pretty cool though. I'll give it that for the geek fuel. And last but not least, we got a loot crate here. The DX, I should say. Loot Crate DX. I believe it's Build. Loot Crate DX. We got a ceramic salt and pepper set of Tetris. They love their salt and pepper shakers. Salt is that. Pepper is that. Peppa. Salt and pepper. Robotech. 
They love these little things. Veracek fighter. I'm gonna have to like do a mystery box and put like all these things in it. This is actually pretty cool, even though I'm not a big Joffrey fan. Game of Thrones, the Iron Th the Iron Throne Room, 314 pieces. That's pretty cool. You could get other stuff in there. I have some of the pieces already. Not of this, but I have a Tyrion. I have a Jon Snow. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool Game of Thrones. Can't wait for you to come back. Very excited. We got a Captain America socks. Men's crew socks. Whoa. So, Captain America shield, as you can see, on there. Pretty cool. The Power Rangers pin. February 2017 build. Megazord pin. We created nothing. <coughs> Fantastic Beasts Deluxe Book at Model Set. So that's pretty cool. I've never even seen this movie. I heard mixed things of it, but that's pretty cool. And this is our card. So we got salt and pepper shakers. The Megazord blueprint pin. Bonus loot wear socks. So these are loot wear socks. So that's a bonus. Pretty cool. Robotech, Baratech, fighter figure. Game of Thrones construction set. And last but not least, Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them, Incredibuild, Swooping Evil Book, and Model Set. So there you go, guys. That's our Loot Crate DX, our Geek Fuel, and our Band Box. So there you go, guys. Like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. Those are the three boxes. What do you think of them, make of them? I think it's just a hodgepodge of stuff. For February 2017, post your comments below. Let us know what you think. Let us know what credits you get. And as always, thank you for watching, and you guys are awesome.